Welcome back. On this week's special edition, we'll be talking about Veterans Day and Thanksgiving. We hope you enjoy. and that means Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving falls on a Thursday this year. Um, Thanksgiving falls on a Thursday every year, Wyatt. <laughs> Let's see what Emily Lockridge has to say about Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving is upon us again, and this is a holiday that began with people coming together and celebrating what they had achieved and being thankful for those around them. Thanksgiving began when the pilgrims and the Indians came together to celebrate their bountiful harvest. The harvest that they had grown together because they lived and worked in harmony. We still celebrate this holiday of the day because everyone needs to stop every once in a while and realize how much they have and everything they can be thankful for. So please, this holiday, spend time with family and friends and be thankful for everything and everyone you have. I'm Emily Lockridge reporting for UCTV News. Back to you. Thank you, Emily. So what's your favorite part about Thanksgiving? Eating. Duh. <laughs> What do we have next? It looks like we're going to send it over to Carson Logan and see what he has to say. Alright guys, I'm here with all first graders and I have Dagan right here, Easton, and then Isabel over here. I'm going to ask them a few questions about Thanksgiving. So Dagan, what's your favorite thing to do on Thanksgiving? Um, play. You like to play? Yeah. How about you? Eat. You like to eat? Play with my food. You like to play with your food? <laughs> Alright, so what's your guys' favorite thing to eat on Thanksgiving? Chicken. You like chicken? Turkey. Turkey? Chicken. <laughs> and she likes chicken too. So, what are you guys thankful for on this Thanksgiving? Food. Food? Food. Food? Food. Y'all like food too. <laughs> Thank you guys for, having on, for coming on, and y'all have a happy Thanksgiving. That was great, Carson. So those kids eat chicken on Thanksgiving? Yeah, well, I'm having spaghetti. Interesting. Let's switch gears. Veterans Day was this past Sunday. We want to thank all the veterans that have served for our country. Here's Thomas Morris with more on Veterans Day. Veterans Day today represents all major international conflicts the U.S. has been involved in, including World War I, World War II, the Korean War, the Vietnam War, the First Gulf War, the Iraq War, and the Afghanistan War, as well as many other more minor combat situations in between. On Veterans Day, we remember and honor all who have served in our nation's military, regardless of how, when, or where they served. We honor their patriotic commitment and their sacrifices of safety, comfort, and well-being, as well as that of their families. This day is just as important as Memorial Day because of the deep and lasting effects that military service has on individuals, even when they come home safe. It is vital and perhaps even more important that we remember and respect those who do come home as they often face great challenges in adjusting to normal life again, especially if they return wounded physically or emotionally. As, they, as those who have stayed safe and out of combat, it is now our duty to help those who have served and serve them as best as we can. This is Thomas Morse, UCTV. Thank you, Thomas. And thank you, veterans. Thanks for joining us on our special Veterans Day and Thanksgiving edition. I am Olivia Nelson. And I am Wyatt Norton. And, and this, this is UCTV. UCTV.